nappy-headed black girl, where all hair is good hair. Hello, beautiful people. It's nappy-headed black girl. And today I'm gonna to share three things I wished I knew before going natural. But before we get started, leave a comment sharing what you wish you knew. Number one, detangling is some hard work. Folks on YouTube make it look so easy. First, you part your hair into four sections. I do mine in the shower so that the running water helps. Then you put lots of conditioner and use a wide tooth comb and just go through it. It's like magic. All lies. Look here, my logo, the broken comb, that's from real life experience. When I first got my dreads done, the lady broke the comb in my hair. So as you can imagine, detangling was not fun for me. And I hated it. That may or may not be part of the reason why I'm a dread today. Number two, natural hair does not automatically equal easy hair. Let me be clear. Having natural hair is awesome, but it doesn't mean that you're gonna be on easy street. Sure, you don't have to worry about chemicals or overprocessing or reversion, but natural hair still takes work. I think a lot of people just see natural hair as freedom and that's true, it is. But as the saying goes, freedom ain't free. I'm a lazy natural, I hate to admit it, but it's the truth. I used to brag about it, but it took a toll on my hair. For example, the ends of my dreads started thinning out really badly. Then I got lazy with washing and my hair was crispy like a taco. It's gonna take some time, but trust me, you wanna learn your hair and how to properly take care of it. Number three, it's okay to buy commercial products. Look, everyone doesn't wanna be a kitchen titian. You know, those people who whip up fantastical natural products using only the herbs that they grow in their garden and unsourced oils sent from overseas. <laughs> that's awesome, but that's not me. And it doesn't have to be you. Don't be ashamed if you buy your products from Walmart instead of an Etsy shop. Likewise, don't trip if the hottest natural hair product does nothing for you. Back when I was a newbie, castor oil was it. The magical fixer for all your natural hair woes. But on these naps, castor oil sits like lard. Makes my hair heavy and limp and greasy. Had me walking around looking like an 80s movie mobster. Not a sexy look. Moral of the story, do what works for you, not what works for everyone else. And that's a wrap. Thanks for hanging. I'm Nappy Headed Black Girl and I'll see you next time.